This video will show you how to inspect the simulated cut model with Veracut's analysis tool, Xcaliper. Here we have a Veracut project open. The Veracut setup is complete, and now we can play the simulation. In Veracut, the simulated cut model can be measured just like a part in an inspection department. Wall thickness, drilled hole diameters, positions and angles of a feature can all be measured. Xcaliper enables you to take measurements and obtain historical and mathematical information about the simulated cut model. Measurements in Xcaliper are relative to the active coordinate system. Let's make program zero the active coordinate system. Let's also make it visible. We can use the workpiece view or machine view to inspect the simulated cut model. Let's display a single view of the workpiece and let's also hide the fixture to get better access to the stock. Xcaliper has several measurement options under the Xcaliper tab. The results from Xcaliper measurements are displayed in the Veracut logger in its own tab. The feature history option is used to display historical and mathematical information and the NC program's history of a cut feature. The historical data includes NC program file name, record number, and the NC program record responsible for cutting the feature. It also includes the tool and feed rate used to cut the feature. This function is useful to spot check machined features and determine the source of an error identified by Veracut. The thickness option is used to measure the distance through material. A vector normal to the surface at the point selected is displayed, and the distance to the point where the vector exits the material is reported as the thickness. The plane angle option allows you to quickly measure the angle between any two planes. Clicking on the dimension opens the Extra Settings dialog window and allows you to change specific characteristics about the measurement. The Distance Angle option is used to measure the distance and or angle between any combination of two points, planes, axes, model or component origins, circles, or edges formed by intersecting planes. The dimension labels can be removed by left-clicking a dimension label and choosing Remove Dimension, or by clicking the Remove All Dimensions icon. To assist with the inspection process, we can use the Section feature. The features in this window enable you to define section planes through any specified models. You can define as many section planes and in any orientation you desire. The section plane orientation and distance are described with respect to the active coordinate system. With the model sectioned, you can continue to simulate your NC programs or restore the original, unsectioned model. We can also measure a blind hole's depth. The hole depth is the length of the cylinder between the plane and its intersection with the cone at the bottom of the hole. The Display Tool to Stock Collisions option is used to highlight collisions between the tool holder and the simulated cut model. This feature is only active when a holder has collided with the cut model at some point during the simulation. And that's it. For more information on the features you have seen here, see the Veracut Help. Or for a step-by-step -step training session, see the Veracut Welcome screen.